and what's up? I know it's been like forever since I last updated, right? Well, things have been going kind of, kind of pretty good, sort of. I've been worked more than usual. My hours have gone up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. You would have think I would have updated more before this, right? Um, finally got my room clean. It's like fantastic. You see, it's awesome. Oh, you want to see where my desk is? It's in this little corner. Look at my awesome corner. Can you guys tell I like wolves? Oh, and I gotta show you. I gotta show you. My head. I'll show you. The newest one I've been working on. Um, uh, working on a new fursuit head. I went to a birthday party and did some fursuiting there. Yes, I fursuited in a bowling alley. I know, right? But they said as long as I wear the bowling shoes, it'll be all right. So, I wore the bowling shoes and went bowling. You know how hard it is to bowl with big, fluffy fingers? I mean, take the size of your finger it is now and multiply it by like three. Big, fluffy fingers. It's kind of obnoxious. Been kind of getting frustrated a lot lately. And kind of going in and out of depression again with uh, the whole trans thing it's kind of it's kind of a uh, I came out to my mom all right and I was like mom pretty sure I'm supposed to be a guy and everything she goes no you're just gay really Really? I'm just gay. I'm just gay. Awesome. I have noticed um, I've got a couple of sparse little chin hairlings. We call them we call them my man hairs because they're they're really coarse and they're pretty thick for facial hair for me. And I get the peach fuzzies here. And then I've got fuzzy here. And I'm not even on tea or anything, so that'll that's kind of promising. I'm really hoping that um that once I get on tea I'll be able to be like ZZ top or something. No, I couldn't do that. <laughs> I couldn't grow a full beard. I'd look like a leprechaun. Thinking about taking a commission for a fursuit, even if it's just, you know, a head or a partial or whatever, um, kind of getting excited about that. Because the last head I sold, <sighs> excuse me, uh, the last head I sold was a head and a, how long was the tail? Three foot long tail, the nice big candy cane, well you guys have seen the video, that big old tail. And the head sold for 450 which I was, huh? Yes, it was 450 No, it was 450 well, Whatever, it was a very significant amount. And, uh, so we were pretty, we were pretty excited about that. And poor Tyler, poor Tyler, my first year. Come here, buddy. He he needs a bath. He's horribly ruffled and kind of getting a little dingy. We actually got um my friend's little stepbrother. It's it's actually the day that we went to his birthday party. I brought I brought Tyler with us, and we got him into the whole suit. It was the most amazing thing I'd ever seen. It was like furry in the making. Because he's he's about this tall on me. I'm only 5'4", so he's like, he's, what is he, 5 foot? He's like, he's about 5 foot even. So imagine 5 foot with the big ears and all the fur. It was hilarious. 
I was like, oh my god, this is the best thing ever. And then we made him walk around the entire neighborhood with it on. And he was like, I can't breathe. It's so hot. So I told him to pop the lower jaw. So what's he do? He goes like this. <laughs> what's he do? He goes like this. <laughs> like something you would have seen out of a horror movie, only it was like all foam and then a human mouth at the back of it. It was it was pretty entertaining. Um, he managed to rip one of the toes off of my feet somehow. Uh, he did that when he was taking them off, but that's that's nothing a little hot glue can't fix. But um, we have oh, well, I have a tail. I have a tail that is green with the white tip. Um, it has the fur belt loops sewn onto it. Um, stands it's about this long. So that's yeah. So it's it it's just it comes up to it hits the backs of my ankles when I'm wearing it. Um, it's got some pretty swishy movements. Um, we just need uh, a little extra money right now. So, who wants it? You want it? You want to take it home? Um, I figure depending on how much it goes for, I might include something, something, like a doodle or something. Which I probably will include a doodle anyway, it doesn't matter. Um, I'm trying to think of what else. I can't really think of anything. That still trips me up though. No, you're not a boy, you're just gay. Thanks, Mom. I was watching somebody on YouTube the other day and they were talking. It was Video Kid Sam, as a matter of fact. And he was like, so, I talk very girly. And I was like, dude, I completely understand. What ticks me off the most lately, though, is when I get mammed at work. I'm like, eh. It's kind of like, God, I can't remember the name of the movie. There's this movie where it's a bunch of cops. And I'm sure... Plenty of you will get this and yell at me for not knowing the title of the movie, but it's a movie with the cops, and they're and they start talking about shenanigans, and I, and the one police chief was like, "I'm swear to God, I'm gonna pistol whip the next guy that says shenanigans," and I'm like, "I want to stand up on the counter and says the next person that calls me ma'am is getting a fist in the face," but I can't do that because I work at Hallmark. I can't just stand up on the counter and go, BRING IT ON, BITCHES! Just can't do it. That's like... Also, if you guys have any video ideas or discussion comments or something along those lines or something, email me. That's about all I can think of. So, if you guys got any questions or comments or anything, Shoot me a mail through here or something, and I will talk to you guys later. Peace.